baby tick for tick baby tick Can you dig a tucker? Yeah. yeah. Oh, we could be like Mac into a rap into a, but I'm just exiting to not back up in the days I run game on. Game. They want to play games, so I bought a Lexus from my. Can you feel me? Yes, yes, I BK. Look, yeah, we got something amazing. 1990. It's 2022 now, girl. 1990 was the year that, the, that, that Cape Town introduced South Africa, the world, to hip hop music. From Cape Town. And I said that wrong. <laughs> Wait, let me say it again. 1990 was the year that Cape Town introduced the world to us, to our hip hop music. You feel me? In 1980, Rapper's Delight came out with that number. In 1980, ten, just only 10 years before that. And it's two completely different environments, cuz. What did these Owens say? Yo, that's, that's crazy, cuz. Even to take a, like, it's difficult for Caledons to do things, to get things moving and to make things happen. In, 1980, in 1990, they made it happen for Cape Town. That's miles. And then you get people dusting uh, Ready D them and say, how can you? When it's because of them, why are you even making music? But you want to make the songs about them. But it's because of them, why you can even make the song? I even know of hip hop here in, in, Cape, in South Africa. You feel me? And they did it for the same reason America did it. To create awareness for the oppression and things like that. You know what I mean? They made songs to show you how it's easier. You see what I mean? Calling out for help and things like that. That's why they made it. Same reason why America did it. And hip hop wasn't just rap, it was graffiti, break dancing, all the elements of hip hop. You feel me? Then, whoa. Then they decided to make a number called Our World. You feel me? Let me see. Am I. Am I and the group's name was Prophets of the City. P-O-C. Can you believe it? I'm sure you've heard it before. Youngsters spoke a lot about them. Look here. I'm going to be honest. Now, I I haven't. I haven't listened to them. I'm not even going to lie. I haven't listened to their music. Maybe when I was a light, maybe I played on SABC 2, you film, but I never listened to them. And that's not quite, man. We from here, we have to, we know everything about Tupac then, but we know nothing about POC. You feel, we need to understand what is going on here as well. So, that's what we're going to do, guys. We're going to, this is the first hip hop song, first rap song ever released. This is a demo called Our World coming out of South Africa, not just out of Cape Town, out of South Africa, guys. POC song of them is Our World. One of the, 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 the homies daddy. Had like a, a small studio. Somehow, I don't know how. And then they also incorporated Ibrahim. That's like a, 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 I think it was a jazz player or something. They used, they sampled that man's music as well. Girl. You people don't even know of the, of the history of, 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 we had artists doing the thing. Jazz players, all that. Like us, cause we had them, but we don't support our people because we don't appreciate our people. The other people appreciate our people. Facts. There's so much talent here, but we don't appreciate each other. We don't. We don't care what you're doing. That's how it is. We don't care about what you're doing. We only, we only want to look at you when you're failing. We don't want to look at you when you're successful because then it's going gonna, it's gonna to make us feel cock. Because then we're going to think, yo, I, why, why, you, why are you winning? But I'm losing. That's how we're going to see it. Whew. I'm not expecting it to be a hit before it plays. I'm not expecting it to be a hit. At all. But this is history. Dude. Look there, cuz. Look at these outwards. Look at that picture. Man looks like who? Man looks like 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 iced tea, cuz. And as I'm sure it's really D it in the front. Look at this cover, dude. <laughs> we always had that jokey side to us. Like, same like funny cop. Everyone got the wig on. You feel me? Everyone is looking like girls. Everyone got no teeth. You feel me? <laughs> That's just. <laughs> I must do another funny cap video, yeah. But look at POC, this is mall. 1990, DJ. Let me keep my big DJ, put it in a dick, and let's show some respect. You one, did? Two, one, two in the town, two, two, <laughs> this is mall, man. This is mall. <laughs> what they gonna say, girl?
Oh siap, kami tu terus ski ini. Oh siap, down to rap we have to do. The third world loves a block away for us. <laughs> this is mal. This is mal. That's in the instrumentation in mind, you know. Of our club, sir. Doesn't give it flavor. Ding, 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 ding. Yeah, you got, you got like, you got. Where you stayed, no? Didn't the club used to come on the weekend? When was it on the sun? On the Saturday or on the Sunday? Didn't they? You dig? In the yellow tracksuits, pink tracksuits, all that. Yeah, no, this is, this is history. That we mustn't lose this, cause, cause eventually someone is gonna delete us of YouTube, and then where are we gonna get this music? Okay, there someone is playing it on an LP, on a on a vinyl. We m- <sighs> keep these ones alive, cause and it's a pity that I just know Lady D, cause we just know Lady 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 D. <laughs> we don't know those three other homies. You feel me? But we need to know these homies. I'm sh- that's small. That's small. That's small. But listen, man, as a club set, man. Over like stuff, but music, or you I like that. I'm not too good at that. Ah, uh, cultural music. Thanks, cuz. Yeah. <laughs> this is ex- look here, cuz. I wasn't expecting that. I'm actually, I actually, I'm proud of the song. I'm not even, because they. They incorporating our cultures, guitar playing as well, man. It's not just South Africans trying to be Americans because I would have expected that because that's all they did. There was no one who did it before them. So obviously you're going to look at the other people who's busy doing it. Like, okay, let's sound like them because the people of today are doing that. Even though they got examples of how to be original, they still copying America. These ones didn't copy America. That. <laughs> yeah, that's that's my that's my respect to the, the four of these ones, facts. And I need all four of their names. I'm gonna Google them again. It's like, I think they're all Muslim. I think I, I might be mistaken. God, I don't know, but that don't even matter. God, but listen, I'm so proud of the song because they're using cultural. They you can feel that you can hear that culture, man. You know what I mean? I don't know if you know what I mean, but I can hear it. You feel me? Standing on the world, you feel me? Just showing Cape Town there on the map. Ah, no. <laughs> you you won't you won't understand how I feel inside. Just hearing the f- like that we had our own sound. We actually they actually had their own sound that sounded like Cape Town. Okay, the accent wasn't too fast. It was a little bit American, but and they didn't have anyone to. The only people that was doing it at the time was America. Now, now we got Cape Townians making music and stuff. At that time, there was nobody, and these Owens still made their own their own sound. Give them respect. Yeah. 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 It's still recording, yeah. What? <laughs> the 
What is it? Okay, I'm in Cape Town rap, but I don't think they're saying that. You feel me? We in the third world. You dig what I'm saying? This music gives me a Leon Suster vibes. I'm not even gonna lie. I'm, I don't even know what I mean. Look at when you watch Leon Suster, no? Millennium Minus. That's when he used to prank people in shop, right? You dig? Didn't you get that? That home feel, man. That feeling of yo. That was at that. You know, it, ah, I can't explain it because it's a nostalgic vibe. You know what I mean? A liquor vibe. And this is what this is giving me. <sighs> yo, it's mouth. Yeah, he let me. You actually feel the song. It's not done. The song isn't done. Got all the elements there, man. It's scratching there, everything. Like if you go to church, no? The homie that, that's playing that bass. You feel me? Especially like that Anna Club kick uh, at that church is where you dance and stuff and you say. Same vibe, girl. Same vibe. Liquor vibe. Get down, rap. I not Cape Town rap. Look at cars basically gonna play out. Nah, let me hear actually. Hold up. Maybe they say something at the end, you do. You did, you did, you did, you did. <laughs> Down to be the place to be, you know what I'm saying? Chill out, homeboy. That's wow. That's wow. Yeah, that's wow. That's wow. Respect to them, guys. Respect to them. Why don't why don't we get taught about this as well? You know what I'm saying? Yeah, these people started something amazing, man. And the first song wasn't even bad for, f- and, it, and it's just these four Owens that did it. And they made a plan. They even signed a distribution deal. They couldn't sign a record deal, like a proper record deal, because Cape Town didn't like the message that they're pushing. I don't know if they didn't like, obviously they didn't like this, you feel me? Plus they didn't like what they were speaking about, saying, yeah, Township rap, Township is the place to be, all that kind, they didn't like that. They weren't feeling that, so they were like, nah, we're not gonna sign you, cuz. So they made a plan and signed a distribution deal, so you know what, the people can still hear them. You, you, you might, you might cut out one chain, but nah, cuz, we're gonna go around, there's nothing, we're gonna climb the wall. You will hear us, basically, is what they did. They made a plan. And to make a plan in 1990. 
as four ladies that that didn't sicker didn't even know what they're doing. You know what I'm saying they just love hip hop, and to this day, if you look at look at Book Up, no, that song with the youngster, or no man, there's a you see how they did this setting there with that that um mixer in his hand, no. He still in his music videos will walk with a with a with a mixer in his hand. Or synthesizer or whatever. You will still walk with that shit in his hand. That's you can see it. this man was so it's passion that, that, that made this man do that. All four of them it was passion that made them do it. See all of them didn't rap. One is a B boy, one is a a, a a mixer, DJ. You feel me? All of them put together as hip hop say P O C respect to prophets of the city. You dig Yo, I, I wanna get one of the albums. I wanna listen to it and actually, yo, what they got to say? Cause why? Why did the people wanna stop them? Why didn't the people wanna sign them? Why didn't the people appreciate their music? Like not the people, the government. You know what I'm saying? Why? Why not? I wanna hear that, cause <sighs> Cape Town, yeah, no. I'm proud of this, cause I'm proud of this. Cause boss life, I be K, cause. <laughs> yeah.